Good morning, this is Sue Rose again with Expert Village. And as you can see, we've gone from this basic piece of white paper with the original drawing to our piece of Arches watercolor paper with the yellow on it, the transparent yellow. And we have used a masking fluid to mask the sun so that it will re remain this yellow color when we erase it. The next color that I'm using is a cadmium red. Again, I use my very large number 30 brush. I put it in the water, blot it, and I dip it into the red. And you start again at the top of your painting and go all the way down. I'm going to want to have this a little darker, so I'm not going to blot it as much. You can see how the yellow shines through. You do not need to worry about streaks or anything on this because it will be covered again. One of the things that I always tell my students in watercolor is that you start and go from light to dark and you always make things lighter than you think because you can always go in and darken them but you can't go in and lighten them. So you can see the blue, which is the masking fluid, remains there and nothing's being bothered by that. So now I have a light layer of the cadmium red on my paper, and I think I want to go a little darker on this. So I'm going to go back over with a little more intensity in the sky. There we go with that step. Stay tuned for the next segment where we are, we'll apply the uh, cerulean blue.